welcome to Evermentor YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to see the Google PhD Fellowship Program. So here, uh, on end average or approximate, if you guys are selected for this fellowship scheme, then you are going to get the 50 lakhs as a fellowship amount on the average, okay, throughout the duration. So share this information to your known ones who are looking for this type of opportunity. It will be really helpful to them, guys. And if you are looking for this type of notifications or else whatever the requirement you are looking for, mention your requirement in the comment section. If I got the suitable notification, then definitely I will come up in the next video. So to get my next videos on notification, subscribe the channel and then tap the bell icon. Before going into the main content of this video, one small announcement from my side is that if you or else your known ones are preparing for the UG Senate or SET or PhD entrance exam or the assistant professor interview for the electronics and communication related thing, then I am providing the wonderful course and you can access this course by downloading the UGCNET 88 app from the Google Play Store and I will give you the complete details regarding this course at the end of this video. And now while coming to the present content of this video, so you just once uh, search with the title that is Google PhD Fellowship 2024 guys. So you will find out all these things. So Google PhD Fellowship Program 2024. So just click on that one and then you will be directed to the complete details regarding this. So Google PhD fellowships directly support graduate students as they pursue their PhD as well as connect them to a Google research mentor. Okay. So nurturing and maintaining the strong relations with the academic community is a top priority at Google. The Google PhD fellowship program was created to recognize the outstanding graduate students doing exceptional work in areas relevant to computer science and related fields. So fellowship support promising PhD candidates of all backgrounds who seek to influence the future of technology. And we currently offer this fellowship in Africa, Australia, Canada, East Asia, Europe, India, Latin America, New Zealand, Southeast Asia and the United States. Okay. So applications are currently open now and you have to submit by May 8, 2024 and the notification of decisions will be announced via email in July 2024. Okay. So if you want to see the eligibility guys, so eligibility is full-time graduate students and pursuing a PhD must have completed all graduate coursework before the fellowship begins. Students must remain enrolled full-time PhD program for the duration of the fellowship or fortified the award. Google employees and their spouses, children and members of their households are not eligible. Students that are already supported by a comparable industry award are not eligible. Government or non-profit organization funding is exempt. So past award is also not eligible. Applicants are evaluated on the strength of the research proposal, research impact, student academic achievements and leadership potential. Research proposals are evaluated for innovative concepts that are relevant to Google's research areas as well as the aspects of robustness and potential impact to the field. So you have to send the proposal guys and uh, here I will show you what are the different fields. Okay. So check down all the yeah research areas so click on the research areas then if you belongs to any one of this research area then you can apply this algorithm and theory if you are if you want to get the clear specializations under the algorithm and theory just click on that one and then you will be directed to few more clarity regarding this one so whatever the uh, recent publications done by the recently qualified candidates so all these things are mentioned here so you can check down uh, data management, data mining and modeling, distributed systems and parallel computing, economics and electronic commerce, education innovation, general science, hardware and architecture, health and bioscience, human computer interaction and visualization, information retrieval and the web, machine learning, machine perception, machine translation, mobile systems, natural language processing, networking, quantum computing, responsible AI, robotics, security, privacy and abuse prevention, software engineering, software systems and the speech processing. So these are the different uh, areas guys and uh, if you want to submit your application then I will show you uh, just uh, click on this India and Southeast Asia so PhD students apply directly be, uh, during the application window and if you are having any some FAQs that means questions are there let's once check the uh, FAQs here whether your FAQs are covered or not so what does the Google PhD fellowship include student receive named fellowship which include a monetary award okay so how much amount you are going to get as per the country wise dimension so for indians up to four years 
so us dollars 50000 dollars to cover the stipend and other research activities travel expenses including overseas travel and google research mentor also available it is for the early stage phd for the late stage phd candidates only one year fellowship will be there that is the two ten thousand dollars will be available as a fellowship so the country wise also i may check down is my university eligible for the phd program or not that one also i may check down so indian candidates applications are open to universities institutions in india okay so latin america excluding cuba and in eligible southeast asian countries region so you guys can apply guys you just check down and what are the eligibility requirements for the students so students must remain enrolled full time in phd uh, program for the duration of the fellowship and as i already shown to you okay anyhow before applying once go through the all faqs very clearly and all the research areas very clearly and then start applying for this programs okay so it is a thing guys and uh, subscribe the channel to get the more details like this and before closing this video as i already told you that at the end of this video i will tell you about the electronics and communication course details so you can download the ugsnet 88 app from the google play store and it is official logo and after downloading you just look for the uh, course name that is net or set electronic science full video recorded course and in this one uh, whatever the subjects related to electronics and communication all the subject wise folder i kept so you can access the uh, topic wise uh, videos class videos as well as the pdf files means notes also available and previous year questions video solutions are also available few so have a look at this one very clearly and take the subscription for this one thank you